him a few shirts short of a load, 77. No, I'm not joking. I thought I was done. Don't worry about it. It could be dangerous. No one will even notice. Well, you know how serious a matter shirt safety is. What happened? I don't think I need to impress upon you the seriousness of these events. The Emmy itself is something for all of us to celebrate. I am just really, really proud of uh, the cast and the crew. They did a phenomenal job. We believed in the project so much, but it was finally um, great to hear that someone else found the value in, in our work. Inspector 42 is a film set in the 50s, and it's about a shirt inspector who lets a few faulty shirts through in order to meet a quota. But what ends up happening is these shirts end up causing a series of horrific disasters, uh, ultimately, which leads to people's deaths. The film is set in a shirt factory, and that alone makes it incredibly complex to pull off on a student level. And so in so many ways, just creating the world that we wanted to tell our story in was pretty ambitious. All of the crew was volunteer. We had anywhere from about 40 to 50 students on set. It was just people who were willing to come out and help on this really rather unique and special project. Most student films usually don't approach things quite this large or this complex. While there was certainly professional advice and faculty guidance, the hands that were on the cameras, the dollies, the lights, you name it, were all students. We could not have made this film if we weren't at BYU. It just couldn't have happened. The resources here are pretty phenomenal. The fact that we were able to shoot it on 35, do a 5-1 surround mix, were things that very, very few film schools have access to. The very first idea for this film came about six years ago. I had bought a new shirt, uh, and as I was putting it on for the first time, I looked in the pocket and there was a tag and it was inspected by 42. So what is a shirt inspector's worst nightmare? Well, someone dies from one of the shirts they inspected. It all started because of the real Inspector 42. The motto in the factory, and there's a big sign in the film for it, is called Think Shirt Safety. What it basically means for the characters in the film is be proud of your work and do it well and do the best that you can because um, you want to produce the best product for people out there. We hope that people will see that you know, the students at BYU are great filmmakers, that they can do a lot of really great work. I hope an award like this Emmy helps other students to see that they shouldn't ever put a limit on themselves. And remember, think shirt safety. Think shirt safety. You're going to be great. Thanks, 42.